Yo, what's up? Thanks for checking out my video. I've been wanting to do this one for a long time. Um, comparing Bud Light to this Bud Light Platinum, which you've never seen that before. That's what we're checking out today. So a little bit windy here on the beach, but a pretty awesome place to do this review. So excuse the windy audio, but anyway, let's just kind of get right into it. So obviously you got Bud Light. I think everybody's pretty familiar with that. Um, what's interesting here with this Bud Light Platinum, uh, the main thing about it, is it has 6% alcohol. Where regular Bud Light, I wanna say it's around, I think it's about three to 4%, something like that. I'll look it up and check it out down below, but this is pretty much almost, I would imagine around double the amount of alcohol. And a triple filtered, whatever. I mean, it's still, uh, it's, you know, it's Bud Light, whatever, but you know, it's still just a mass production beer. Uh, but anyway, let's just check both of them out. First of all, we're gonna pour them in the glasses here just to check out Oops, a different color. And you'll see that the platinum's a little bit darker. And I am gonna drink both of these beers pretty quick in the sun, which that's gonna be pretty awesome to get a nice little buzz going on. Why not? It's Labor Day weekend down at Folly Beach, right outside of Charleston, South Carolina. Pretty awesome. This is actually sponsored by my vacation rental company, um, which I'm gonna put a link down below to that too. All right. Let's just check those out. You know what, actually, I'd always thought it was a little bit darker um, in color, but uh, heck, you know what, it's, it's really not. Um, I don't know why I thought that in the past. I've drank this Bud Light Platinum a couple times. But anyway, it really looks identical. Yeah, interesting, so. Uh, yeah, your typical Bud Light, you know, just pretty much uh, your standard American Pilsner mass-produced beer, and uh, probably everybody out there is pretty familiar with that taste. Uh, platinum certainly has a Pilsner taste, just a little bit more hoppy, just a little bit, not much. I would not put it in the classification of any kind of craft beer, but it does have a more robust taste than the Bud Light. And uh, more booze in there, so yeah. So anyway, um, it's roughly about the same price too. It's not very much more expensive, maybe a dollar or two more for a 12 pack like that. If you've never tried it before and you like that kind of mass produced beer, I would say give it a try. Although be careful, you can get wasted on this stuff pretty quick at 6%. Um, and a lot of times something like Bud Light, Miller Light, any of those kind of light beers, you know, they're kind of a good summertime day drinking sort of beer out on the boat or whatever because hell it's half water anyway and it's not getting you too wrecked um so that's the only thing i would recommend you know caution against it could get you pretty pretty wasted you don't need a dui certainly don't need to get in an accident certainly don't need to you know uh, have any illegitimate children or anything like that making bad decisions so anyway um an interesting product it was on sale that's why i bought it i also wanted to do this comparison video but anyway what do you think comment down below do you like this product do you think it's a gimmick um, do you just hate Bud Light in general? Do you think, do you hate me? I really don't care. You can comment down below, say anything you want, but just uh, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button. Why not? It feels good, I promise. I'm gonna get around to uh, get back to drinking these beers here, kind of light my uh, Labor Day weekend off. Yeah, later.